Und wen haben wir denn da? <lacht> Froschkönig? Excuse me. Oh, hi. Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. I don't know if you remember me. I've uh, seen you around, but you may have forgotten. I know who you are, Flycatcher. You, you've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? <laughs> I think I've lost count. But you know, Crane uh, let me go recently. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I mean, it's no big deal. So, what brings you here? I mean, can I help you with anything? Are you here to see one of the brothers? D or Dumb? I was hoping to have a talk with D or Dumb. Do you know where they are? No, they don't really keep regular hours as far as I can tell. Sorry. It's been a, a quiet night so far. I think the twins are out, probably working on a case. Sometimes I don't see them for days. They gave me the job after Crane told me to get lost. He said I was just in the way. Where's their office? Oh, right this way. I, I was going there next anyway. Das trifft sich gut. You, want. you can wait for them there. Sure, thanks. No problem. I'm gonna have to take a look around. Uh, well, I, I guess that would be okay. I wasn't really asking for permission. Right, you're the sheriff. I just don't want to get in trouble or anything. I'm sure it's fine. I mean, they never told me. Wir werden ihn nicht in Schwierigkeiten bringen. Das ist nicht unsere Intention. I won't get you in trouble. Right. So, und wir schauen uns mal um. Oh, wir nehmen als erstes den Aktenschrank. Ah, interessant. Ich glaube, wir sind im Gedächtnis geblieben. Der große böse Wolf. Buhu. Ich glaube, die mögen uns nicht. Let's see if they got a file on Crane. Oh ja, wir haben definitiv eine Akte über Crane, aber wir beginnen mal vorne. Wir haben hier die Akte von Bell. This is worse than I thought. Ja, eine Aufstellung der Schulden. Shit. Die hat sich bei dem falschen Geld geliehen. Schauen wir uns Brannigan an. Wie wir auch immer Brannigan war. Ich mich nicht dran entsinnen. Detective Brandon. Ah, the detective. Okay, jetzt weiß ich es doch wieder. Aber Cinderella sind wir definitiv noch nicht begegnet. Cinderella ist nicht mehr hier, sie ist irgendwo in Europa. Jetzt haben wir hier die Akte von Crane und von Donkey Skin Eselfell. Wir wissen, Eselfell war Face. Deswegen schauen wir uns die als allererstes mal an. Crane hired them to look for a photo, so that's why they were at her apartment and the woodsman's place. Und final schauen wir uns jetzt die Akte von Crane an. Ichabod Crane. He owes the crooked man money. Shit. Was he planning to pay this all back? Request for property acquisition with further details filed under donkey skin. Why did he want it back so badly? Find anything? Not what I need. I, I know these guys can come off abrasive at times, but they aren't so bad once you get to know them. Oh, ich glaube, wir haben ein falsches Bild von den beiden. They're kind of loud at times, but you get used to it. They only care about helping criminals. No, I think you've got the wrong idea. They help all kinds of people. They're detectives. Anyone can come in here with a problem and they'll do their best to fix it. The way Dee explains it, it's like if someone lost their cat, well, they could hire them to, you know, track it down. Or like sometimes they get packages for people. They can be like couriers, you know? Or who? All kinds. Come to think of it, I don't really know where they keep them. Anyways, I'm just saying, you just don't know them like I do. Sure, Flycatcher. Ja, ich glaube doch, dass er ein bisschen naiv ist. Wir sprechen ihn aber jetzt nicht an, sondern wir schauen einmal hier weiter. Jetzt haben wir hier den Posteingang. Dear Brother Dumb, I hate dogs and you know it. Sincerely, Brother D. What's that about? They do have their quirks. Ach, 
streiten die sich gegenseitig? I'm just saying. Look, just trust me on this. Tweedledee and Dumb are not nice. They're not helping anyone. Well, they helped me. Okay, great. They helped you. That's one person. Now, please, just let me concentrate here. Die Lollis, der andere Posteingang. Dear Brother D, I think we should get ourselves a dog. Sincerely, Brother Dunn. Couple of freaks. <sighs> This is pointless. W what, if, what if you're wrong about them? I'm not. Er probiert uns sure, unbedingt zu überzeugen. Mean everything people say about them is true. I mean, you know, like when I think about it, you guys aren't that different. Oh, you help doch. people, and they help people. Let's get one thing straight. They are nothing. Like me. Bigby? Shit. There's something here. I know there is. There has to be. Why would there be anything Because to... Because they're lying to you. Okay, Flycatcher? That's why. They aren't detectives. They're somehow involved in the murders, Flycatcher. Two fables are dead. Bigby, what happened to your... Oh nein, die Wunde geht auf. You wanna know what this is? This is them showing up to Lily's funeral with fucking shotguns. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I, 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 I didn't know. And it doesn't matter if they're really good at hiding their shit, but they're involved all right in all of this. Do you get it now? I wanted him actually not so anfahren, but I think anders begreift er es auch nicht. I didn't mean to. There's a door behind this file cabinet. Now, I don't know what they keep back here, but it might be what you're looking for. Er hilft uns. Der Schlüssel ist in der Zigarrenkiste. Vielen Dank. Das hilft uns definitiv weiter. Okay, das war unspektakulär. Dann schließen wir es mal auf. Es geht runter in ein Kellergewölbe. Sieht ein bisschen aus wie ein Lagerraum. Wow. Okay, schauen wir uns mal um, was haben wir hier? Ah, hier haben wir ein paar Päckchen von ihrem Kurierdienst. I'm sorry, I know I'm late. I'll get it to you soon. Ach, guck mal. Who was he sending money to? Crooked man. Care of the lucky pawn. You know what that is? Gelder, die er verschieben wollte. Die stecken wir doch mal ein, wenn wir es können, oder? Ja. Damit stören wir so ein bisschen deren Infrastruktur. Is that what you needed? I don't think so. But it's interesting. There's more going on here. I still need to find that witch though. What are you looking for exactly? Maybe I can help. Anything about Crane or the witch he was using. Something. Durch das Verschieben der Dose ist allerdings noch ein Päckchen zum Vorschein gekommen. Das schauen wir uns jetzt auch mal näher an. Hey, Bigby. Do you think after all this, do you think I could come back to the Woodlands? Since Crane let me go. I mean, I can still work here, but I don't think I want to now. I don't want to work with bad people, you know? You should talk to Snow. Maybe there's something she can do for you. Really? That would be... thank you. Scheint so ein netter Typ zu sein. It's Snow's hair. Snow White? Why... We found her hair like this inside Lily's glamour. 
Anti-Greenleaf. This must be the witch Crane was using. I guess D and Dumb were getting the hair for Crane and sending it to her? That's not a pleasant thought. There's no address on it. So, so what now? Snow would probably want to know about this. I'll check in with the business office. Maybe there's a record of Auntie Greenleaf. I think I saw a phone near the back. Thanks. You're welcome, Sheriff. Business office, this is Snow White. Hey, Snow. Oh, it's you. Sorry, I've been answering angry phone calls for hours. People want to know where Crane is. How'd it go with the Tweedle brothers? No address yet, but I got a name for Crane's witch, Auntie Greenleaf. You heard of her? No. I'll get Buffkin started looking for a record, but it might take some time. Huh. Somebody's got to know where to find her. And Snow, I found a note with some money attached. Crane has been embezzling from Fabled Town. Of course, because why half ass being a complete sleazeball? Do you think this is tied to the murders? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. I think it's connected. Maybe the girls found out about it? I don't know. Hmm, maybe. You might want to try Holly's place, see if she hasn't burned Lily's things yet. Or Crane's, you might find something there. Although, Bluebeard's been there. I'll leave it up to you, but we don't have much time. Crane is meeting her at 2 a.m. Ich glaube, da ist das Trip Trap am effektivsten. Ich hätte jetzt gedacht, dass Snow dahin geht. Deswegen werden wir das abklappern. Ich glaube, in Crane's Apartment werden wir nichts finden. I'll go to the Trip Trap, see about Lily's things. I think that's our best option. Sounds good. Just, just be gentle with Holly when you get there, okay? Oh ja, das müssen wir definitiv. I'll give Buffkin the name and hope he finds something in the records. Let me know what he comes up with. I'll be in touch. I hope you'll do the same. We'll catch him, Snow. Bigby, I have to go. Someone just came in. Good luck. Und wir sind an der Trip Trip Bar angekommen. <lacht> She's asleep, you fucking idiot. Guys, open up. It's the sheriff. Hey, look, Woody, it's the sheriff. Well, come on in, buddy. Brent, what? He's a traveler. A weary traveler in search of some hospitality, right? Just what in the fuck is wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me. In fact, I'm in a good goddamn mood. I think it's good that he's a good Launard. This is komisch. Sollte ich dem Frieden trauen? Könnte auch an den Medikamenten liegen. I want a drink. Anybody else want a drink? Friend, Swinehart said you shouldn't mix you it. You think I give a fuck what that fucking guy says? Or what you say? Grant, really, you shouldn't drink right now. You should quit while you're ahead with that stuff. I might need your help. Holly's asleep in back, but you won't be able to wake her. Really? Well, the doc gave him both barmesidal ambrosia for the pain. Look, the deal is, if you resist going to sleep, like I am right now, it gives you a very, very, very nice high. Okay, er ist völlig bereit, weil er gegen das Medikament ankämpft. Yes, he did. He certainly did. But let me tell you something. I haven't felt this good in a long time, fat boy. Have you seen her sister's things? What wasn't burned at the funeral? I saw her come in with something, but I didn't see where she put it. Nope, haven't seen it. That funeral back there? That was a shitty fucking send-off for a pretty okay lady. Yeah. You weren't fucking there. I'm talking to Bigby now, okay? 
Can't say you being there helped things much. Gren, don't start nothing. Who's starting anything? I'm not. You think I shot up the place? It wasn't my fault. They got away, though, didn't they? Whatever. It's all right. I'm too out of it to get into it. I want to clear the air. We're all in this dung heap of a fucking shit town together. We're all gonna have a toast. All of us. Fellas, I'm here for one thing. To look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Now, yeah, I... yeah, I know, I know. And I want to help you, okay? And I will. But first, indulge me. It'll take two seconds. As a show of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. Grand Bigby didn't come here to get loaded with. I don't want to get loaded with it. It's just a quick slug. I'm not going to hurt anybody. We haven't reached our goal yet. And we haven't seen these things. Alright, now help me. Gren, the doc said you needed to rest. How many times you fucking gonna warn me about it, huh? You're not my fucking mother, so just get off my back! I said I was sorry, all right? I can't do anything about it, it's done! <lacht> what more do you want? What else can I fucking say here? Cut this shit out now, I don't care what it's about. Oh, I forgot. You haven't heard the news. This walking lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our backs. And oh, Holly had to find out going through all of her sister's shit. What fun that must have been. Also noch ein trick after trick of this fat ass and Lily. I didn't plan for that, all right? And our thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. It wasn't. I never fucked her when she was snowing. I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew Holly would flip out. And you knew for a damn good fucking reason. You know what? Fuck this. I don't need this shit. Oh yeah, that's it. Now you're teary-eyed. You were always such a low life. I don't know why I never realized it till now. What do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can think whatever he wants. I don't give a shit. I think whatever happened was between them. And Lily is dead. So let's put this whole thing to rest, Gren. Gren. I don't know where Lily's shit is. <sighs> Check Holly's room, I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's the role. I thought you said you would help me look. Actually, Big B, if you'll excuse me, it seems that I'm gonna pass out. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. <laughs> Red wird sich nicht daran erinnern, ja. Er ist fertig. Schläft tief und fest. Jetzt gilt es, die Überbleibsel zu finden. Was können wir hier tun? Im Regal nichts. Toilette nichts. Kiste mit Alkohol. Ich werde das Gefühl nicht los, wenn wir die untersuchen, machen wir Krach. Ah, wir probieren es aus. Es war so klar. Naja. Sonst können wir hier in der Ecke nichts mehr tun. Jetzt haben wir hier die Liege und Holly. Dann untersuchen wir mal die Liege. Dort ist die Kiste. Ach, sehr gut, sie dreht sich. Jetzt kommen wir an die Kiste heran. Die sollten wir uns auch direkt schnappen. Oh 
Einzige Tor. Aber sie erkennt uns nicht. Woody, is that you? Yeah, sure. Woody, bar's closed. And Lily ain't around anyway, so you can run off back to the woods, I guess. Okay, sie erkennt uns nicht als Big B. Ich glaube, dann hätte sie anders reagiert. Sehr gut. Wir nutzen jetzt die Zeit zum Untersuchen. Das ist, glaube ich, eine Flasche von dem Wein, den wir auch entdeckt haben in dem Zimmer. Wir sollten ihr auf jeden Fall ein gutes Gefühl geben, auch wenn wir nicht der Holzfäller sind. Ich denke mal, das kann der Holzfäller gebrauchen und das kann sie gebrauchen nach dem ganzen Strapazen des Tages. Wir schauen uns jetzt das Foto an. Schlaf doch bitte wieder ein. Ich weiß nicht, warum du fucking came hier There's nothing left for you to ruin. And I'm not in an entertaining mood. I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry for what happened. I'll make it up to you. Ah, uh, sure you will, kid. When the rivers turn coarse and the sky bleeds fucking gypsies. Jetzt haben wir noch drei Gegenstände. Das ist einmal der Glimmerbehälter. Ist da vielleicht eine Adresse drauf? Anscheinend nicht. Ist auf der Brosche was zu finden? Auch nicht. Dann bleibt uns nur noch das Notizbuch oder das Adressbuch. Lily's funeral. It was just so fucked tonight. But I still wish you could have been there. I just don't know what Big B's doing. If he if he cares about it. If he even gives a shit. I don't know. I don't know why he showed up. I just wish he'd get out of my fucking life. He cares about this, about Lily, about Faith. I know he does. You think so? Yeah. Well, you know him better than anybody, so... Das tut er uns uh, er wirklich. I guess I'll take your word for it. What? If you were getting your glamour on this day... One of these has to be the witch. Auntie Greenleaf. AG. Gotcha. Wir haben die Adresse. Hello, this is Snow White calling. I'm looking for Bigby. Is anyone there? Bigby, if you're there, pick up, okay? Snow? Oh, thank God. Tell me you found something. I got it, Snow. Her address was here with Lily's things. It's on, uh... White Plains Avenue, 1284. It's an apartment complex. Great. Let's get going. Crane's meeting her in a few minutes. All right, let's go. I don't want to miss him. I'll meet you there. All right, I'll see you there. Auf geht's. Ich hoffe, wir erwischen Crane. <lacht> 